what I attempt to do with kids like this is that in the midst of all the, the trauma, the chaos, the horrific things they do, that uh, I always feel like it's incumbent upon me as a therapist working with um, youth who've been traumatized to find the hero in every youth. That there's always some heroic event or some piece of a hero in the midst of this horrific person. And so early on in, in the process of therapy, uh, I, I feel like it's incumbent upon me to find that, that heroic component and to play that back to uh, the client because, because that later serves as a, as a resource and the therapy to build on. So, so tell us about, give us an example of how you do that in a, in a situation with a, a kid where most of us would not think there's a hero buried inside there. Just, we just think, of, well, this is a scary kid. This is a, a tough kid. This is a tough nut to crack. So get, just give us a flavor of how you work and how you, how you uh, begin the process of discovering that. Well, early on, I mean, the, the, the part of this finding a hero is about really finding um, redeemable parts in the young person that, um, and it's kind of like the, this, this um, mantra about love, you know, that, that love denied expression is love denied. And so if I see the redeemable part and fail to comment on it, then it's, it's, it's almost like a failure to see it. So this kid who stormed out, I mean, one of the things I said to him was that, that, um, that, uh, that I admire tremendously about his ability to sort of keep things real in his life. And so when a point in which I had pushed him beyond the point in which he wished to be pushed, that he kept it, he kept it really real with me. Uh-huh. Uh, and that, 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 I, that I appreciate that about him. And that was, that was a redeemable part of him. And so that, and, and, you know, there's always a risk because, I mean, he could have responded by telling me to go to hell and keep that and, and with my psychobabble. But I thought it had resonance with him, and it got some traction with him. And so just that little piece was about finding, the, finding what was heroic in him. Um, and so it, to me, it doesn't matter whether it, it could be the child who grows up in a family of seven siblings, and six of whom are incarcerated or strung out on drugs, and that somehow he managed to escape that narrative. Then, uh, then I identify that as, as the hero in him, that that's the heroic part of him, that that gives me something to work on uh, and something to build on.